Mark, I remember several years ago you predicted that Bitcoin would go to 40,000. Uh, Bitcoin went to 40,000. Now it's back below 40,000. What are your latest thoughts? Oh, you know, when, when I did that, I, I just thought you were going to have um, once a market is created, it's there. That, that, that to me was the reason why I thought it was interesting on Bitcoin. Um, and I thought that as soon as you had institutional investors coming in, the price would move up. Um, I think today, um, I, I don't I honestly don't know where it's going to go, but mm -hmm. you've got that market. It's there. Um, I can make you an argument. It could go to 100, 100,000. I can make you an argument. It could go to sort of 20,000. I, I, I think it, the probability as more and more people keep using Bitcoin, it's going to keep moving up. Um, but yeah, it's happened a little bit quicker than I thought it would. I should have bought a lot more. That was my mistake. Though, <laughs> in, in, ter in, in terms of that delta, the, the 100,000 and 20,000, can it go more than that? And the reason I ask is when it was 5,000, going from 5,000 to potentially 100,000, that was actually a, a, a great bet if, if you believe yeah. that. It's harder today to make that, you know, people then have to sort of make some decisions about whether they want to do this in Bitcoin, maybe they want to try another uh, yeah. cryptocurrency or buy something else in the market that could do better. Yeah, I, it's a great question because right now, you know, you're sort of looking at it and saying, OK, it could go up two or three times or it could go down 50 percent. Mm -hmm. You've got that with a lot of stocks. And I, I think you're absolutely correct. It's changed, whereas I think the first time around, you could be up 20 times. You could be up 10 times and maybe you could lose sort of, you know, 20, 30, 40 percent of your capital. Um, it's changed. It, you're, you're absolutely correct. I think the reward on it is not as high as it used to be. So you don't think the upside, because there's other people who believe, you know, the, 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 the genuine bulls, I don't know if the genuine bulls might say it's worth half a million dollars or a million dollars eventually a coin, in which case the, the, that delta all of a sudden becomes I, I, yeah. potentially more interesting. Yeah, I, I would find that hard. I mean, look, I think in any situation you can find people who are going to tell you something's going to go up 10 times. Um, it's, it's just hard. You've got you've had a lot more acceptance. You've got to end up for Bitcoin to move up. You've got to not have any legal issues. You've not you countries are going to have to say, don't worry, we're going to accept it as a currency. Um, I just don't see that happening anytime soon. I think you're going to be in the world we're in today where there's a little bit of uncertainty. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.